So what actually is going to be happening today? 3 p.m., uh, you've got a slight advantage as Orlando Pirates. Are we going to be seeing a lot of goals? No, not really. Uh, probably maybe on aggregate still draw. Pirate will go through on aggregate. But uh, it's going to be a very interesting uh, match today, very balanced. From the goalkeeping side, you know, we've got two best goalkeepers in the country. Midfield, jam packed, you know, and then up front. But the problem is we, we don't see too much of goal because the, every, both teams, they're flapping all those chances when they come in front of goals. So I don't see uh, many goals today. But I mean, you speak about goals, and that's exactly what kinds of Chiefs need. They need to win by two clear goals if they want to go through. And they've got some class strikers. Can they do it? Look, uh, as I say, uh, we won't see much because if, if you look at the past three matches, both teams, they create so many chances, but they can't score them. So, but you know, Chiefs, uh, they are one goal down. So I think they're going to double their effort to, to try and get those two goals. At the same time, Pirate is already motivated by the, the, the goal they, they've got in hand. Yeah. How important is an early goal in this match? Yeah. If Chiefs score an early goal, probably confidence boost. And they can bank on the second half that they maybe probably they can get another one. And if Pirate scored the early goal, Hopefully, chief spirit will gonna go down, gonna die, and then maybe that's where we can see maybe three, four goals coming from Pirates. Okay, only if you manage to get Chiefs on the back foot early on. Yeah, but but you see, what what I like about two teams is that they both create so many chances, but it's only that they can't score them. Yeah. yeah, creating chances is something that we saw Orlando Pirates do a lot of on Sunday. It was just on Sunday that they progressed to the CAF Champions League semi-finals with that draw against al -Atli, a very tough match. They've only had a day's rest. Are we going to be seeing that on the field today? Yeah, I think that uh, uh, for them to, to qualify to go in the same, that's the moral boost itself. You know, and you know when you play Chiefs, you don't need... Uh, Another motivation, because EA is like a motivator, motivating the motivator. What's it like? I mean, you've played in a number of Soweto derbies. What's it like to walk out onto that field in front of a packed stadium? Yeah, exciting, but sometimes tense, you know, a huge crowd. And then that's where maybe other judgments, they, they, they came in, because that's where we can see whether do you qualify to to play for Chiefs or Pirate, you know, that's, that's where we can see the best of you. So it's the true taste of a player, the Soweto Derby. Exactly. And others, you know, their contracts, they might be expiring now. That's where now they have to convince the crowd and the management that uh, you have to renew this. Wow, so there'll be so much more going on than just the match today at Orlando Stadium. Let's chat a little bit about the other semi-final. It's a bit taking on Platinum Stars. Vitz say that they've got at least two away goals, but I mean, they are trailing 4-2. What can we expect out of that semi-final clash? Yeah, look, Vitz has been doing well, even the Quena. But uh, I, I don't see, I don't see, I, I don't see them scoring uh, uh, two goals. I, I, I don't see, because I know Somebody somewhere is going to pick the bus. He's going to just sit at the back and, and try to demoralize the whole situation or frustrate people there. I, I don't see coming, them coming back. All right. And just to end off, who do you see going through to the finals? Uh, yeah, Dequena and Parrot. Because, look, Parrot already has got the upper hand. Chiefs has got the egg and we got the chicken. So... <laughs> We, we <laughs> pirate this too. <laughs> because you can, I mean, we already won it the last uh, three weeks ago. So, Chiefs, Pirate, Dequena in the final.
Lovely stuff. Thank you very much. Uh, that a former Pirates man, Edward Magent Motale, saying that it is Orlando Pirates that are the chicken and it's Kaiser Chiefs that are only the egg. He backs them as well as Platinum Stars to go through to the MTN8 final because the semi-final second legs are getting underway today. That's how we wrap our sport for.